In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Direct Selection tool. So, the Direct Selection tool is located in the toolbar, and it is the white pointer. It comes in a variety of different kinds uh, of tools, but for the most part, its basic form is just to select direct anchors and paths. Its quick button is A. So when we use the direct selection tool, I'm going to kind of like zoom in here. What it does is kind of like the selection tool, it'll let me select a shape, and then I can click and move that uh, shape around. Um, I can also, if I already have something selected, such as if I switch over to the selection tool, so I've used the selection tool to select it, I can then isolate that I want to work on this one and then move over to the direct select tool. What the direct select tool does, it is allows you to uh, click on and change the anchors. We can see that I'm up at this top right anchor. And if I click on it, you can see how that anchor is uh, filled in, whereas my other anchors you can see are white. And if I click on a different anchor, you can see that it switches it. And so what that allows me to do is it allows me to move around that anchor separate from the other anchors. I can select multiple anchors by clicking and dragging, and you can see that it's selected both anchors and I'm moving both of them together. And just like uh, many other selection methods, if I press shift, I can unselect from things. And if I press shift on unselected parts, I can add those. So I can move those ones together. So this, uh, the direct selection tool allows us to click and drag on the anchors. Um, and to like restructure things. I can also click on a path as you just saw me do, and I can move everything that that path is connected to. So you can see that it's moving both the anchors and the path, so I can restructure this. The direct selection tool is a good tool to use to alter a shape once we have this shape created and we want to just adjust maybe a little bit of its width or height or just move a point from one point to another. So that, is the direct select tool.